Well, the next event on the track, the women's 100 meter hurdles, Felician Canada, drawn in one, Lewis USA two, Crawford USA three, Porter Great Britain four, Pearson Australia five, Caslin USA six, Carruthers USA seven, De Coeur of France in eight, and Diwara of France in lane nine. Sally Pearson, reigning world champion indoors and out. Terrifically quick. Fell in Brussels last year, the only race that she lost. Going so very quickly, couldn't get out of the way of the hurdles. Been in uh, Europe now for six weeks. She's got an 11 second flat 100 meter time. Now that makes a big difference. And when you're going that fast, you've got to be good at getting out of the way of these hurdles. It's called modified sprinting. First hurdle important to establish the rhythm of the race. Well, Pearson already up, Carruthers going quite well in lane three, Ginny Crawford going well, but this is Sally Pearson at her very best, Ginny Crawford in second place at the moment, Pearson leads it, Crawford in second place, in third place, that looked like uh, Tiffany Porter going quite well, Will do. look at the time, 12.40, oh sensational stuff, and uh, clearly if you warm this up, uh, gave her a little bit of a tailwind, this girl is still pushing down towards world record form and I think it'll come for her, if not this summer, then next year. We saw it last year again and again, the consistency is enormous and she's beaten a really strong field there by a couple of metres. Yeah, and for British viewers, Tiffany Porter did get third place with 12.74, uh, with Jenny Crawford at 12.59 in second, but look at the way she gets off the hurdle, she's so down, quick down to the track. Well, there it is, Sally Pearson, 12.40, world leading time. Ginny Crawford, 12.59, the season's best, and Tiffany Porter, that's a good run, 12.74 in third place, ahead of the American Catholic.